I got sick in like 2019 and a year later I was just looking for something to do and we were at the hospital and I saw this poster for Little Red Door and I'm like why don't I try to go to Little Red Door? So then I got started here about two years ago and I've been here ever since. I was a camper at Little Red Door all the way back to 2001. I was diagnosed January 28th of 2000. I've been a camper ever since. Personally, in my heart, I've been a camper. Um, still am. I have the flexibility that I'm like, I need to come. I need to be a part of this for my own heart and so I can make sure that these kids have just as much fun as what I did. So Hazel was diagnosed with B-cell ALL um, leukemia in January of this year, 2021. And she immediately couldn't go to school when she was diagnosed. So Camp Little Red Door gave us an opportunity to be social and meet other families and other people that um, could relate to what we're going through currently. And she's the happiest I've seen her since she was diagnosed, so. This is my first time at day camp. It's really amazing. It's not like sleep away camp, but it's just the same. It's really awesome. And then like meeting new kids who haven't been to sleep away camp. It's just a really awesome experience to see and I love it. When I was three, I had cancer and then I beat it like a year later, I think. Um, but I still took medicine. And then uh, I found Little Red Door. I think my parents found it and said it was like for cancer and stuff. I've made lots of friends because I've been here for three years, I think. And you could invite someone, so I, I keep inviting my sister. Nice experience in camp. He loves it so much. He loves the people. And uh, it's been very welcoming and everyone knows each other really well, it's like family. The first year we came, it was the first year of day camp, and we've been going for four years. So this has been fantastic, the whole safari theme. These kids love it. And those are the kinds of things that make camp memorable. Doing those extra things, making it way out of their ordinary day-to-day -day life, you know, making it memorable and it's beyond important because those are the memories they're going to stick with for the rest of their life. So yeah, I look forward to doing this almost every year until I can't and I'll just be a volunteer. <laughs>